Today I'm going to show you how to install a stainless steel cable tie with a battery powered tool. So the first step in installing a stainless steel tie is make sure you've got the right tool for the job. I've got a battery platform PBTMT today that can do heavy, extra heavy, and super heavy ties. We're going to be installing three extra heavy ties, so I've already got it set to five, but if we needed to adjust that, we just unlock the slide and send it up to scale. Another great thing about the tool is that the head rotates to get into tight application spaces. Go ahead and lock that down. And we're going to be installing, as I mentioned, MLT EHs today. And they've got the great same rounded edges as their standard and heavy counterparts, which protect the installer, but also the cable bundle itself. And even though we might not need it, we're gonna wear some PPE too. So we'll go and wrap the tie around and thread it through the head. And typically you'll see cushion sleeving alongside this application and at various intervals. So first of all, you'd slide the excess strap through the cutting blade and then into the rotating spindle and simply pull the trigger. Thing. Easily thread the tie through, make sure it is wrapped around that mount and around the bundle nice and securely. And finish it off with the tool. Now you'd typically mount on a ladder rack every foot or so, maybe 16 inches, maybe nine. All depends on the application and the engineering requirements at hand. And we would highly advise cushion sleeving in this type of diagonal installation. Just due to the unknown variables of force that are coming at this diagonally.